Minister of Transportation, Rotimi Amechi, says he is the only presidential aspirant who has presided over an insecure state and tackled insecurity successfully as governor. Mm -hmm. Like seriously? For which country? <laughs> In River State. Well, Amechi said of all the presidential aspirants, he was the most qualified because of the experiences he had garnered over almost three decades in policies. He expressed confidence that 99% of delegates from River State would vote for him at the All Progressive Congress presidential primary. Okay, the same vice president will come out and say, oh, he's the most experienced both internationally and locally at a federal level that is the most experienced. Of course, everybody wants to praise him or herself to raise his or herself to high heavens. Father Amechi stated this on Friday in Port Harcourt while addressing party chieftain during a consultation tour of River States, pointing out that he remained a loyal party member and would support anyone who emerged victorious at the APC primary should the party fail to pick him. Of course, you already know that you are going nowhere. <laughs> You already know that you are going nowhere. So this is a, a just a caveat in case. So he's not looking as if uh, he's so desperate. But definitely, yeah, he, would, it will, he wouldn't want a situation whereby the backlash would be so much on him that, oh, you were making mass, you are going to be picked. Oh, you could be the favorite candidate, the anointed candidates and all of that. So he's just trying to put that caveat. To me, this is a sign of, uh, oh, you already seen the handwriting on the wall. And there's an article that was written again that most of the states that he went to, it was not accepted. It was, especially the Lagos states, that one just told him, any form of, a, what is it called, supports for that Lagos, he's for Tinubu. So, don't just bother yourself. Uh, just that uh, the other man, the Oba of Lagos, deceiving him that, uh, ah, forget morals, forget morals. You are fit to be president. You don't forget morals. Uh, if you take that home, now me see, you'll be doing it yourself. The minister said 99% of Rivers delegates will vote for me at the primary. Those who are qualified to vote as Rivers delegates will vote for me. It is not about voting for me because I am your son, but voting for me because what is right is right and what is wrong is wrong. And because of the experience I am bringing to the table of all the aspirants, I am the youngest and the most experienced. I was a speaker for eight years, governor for eight years, and I have done seven years as a minister of transport. I am the only aspirant on the stage that has governed a state where there was insecurity. When I came, they kidnapped Professor Nimi Briggs, former vice chancellor of the University of Port Harcourt. They kidnapped Mrs. Lulu Briggs, wife of the late Oi Mogu, O B Lulu Briggs. Those were the baptism of fire that I faced in the first few weeks after I came into office. After that came the story of how they were kidnapping two month old babies. But we faced those challenges together and we overcame those challenges to free River State. I don't know what the situation is now. I don't live here i live in abuja like seriously you don't live in nigeria must you live in abuja before you know what is happening there even those who are, who are abroad they know what is happening in nigeria they know everything happening in every state abuja to potakot is what you now telling us that you don't know what is happening there. you you you, you lie the apc presidential hopeful disclosed that about 70 percent of politicians in the state passed through him hence he could decipher who had the capacity to lead the state and who would not be lawyer? Amechi said, those of you who are crying now in River State, I want all of you, but you didn't listen. 60 to 70 percent of River State politicians passed through me. So I know the character of everybody. I know who is capable of being a governor and who has no capacity. Concentrate on your presidency. Of course, you've already put the caveat that uh, anybody that emerges as a winner uh the primary you are going to support because you are a lawyer but you guys are just loyal to yourselves but you are not loyal to the nigerian people who always give you votes you are not loyal to them at all so if you have all this experience why is it that she didn't give a your ogre why didn't she give a worry that oh these are these were the things and things and things you did 
that uh, made you to succeed as regards insecurity in River State. Why didn't you give him that? This thing because all of you are still complaining, telling us that uh, if you become president, all the all the nonsense that we are experiencing will be a thing of the past. And yet you cannot even suggest that secret or give that secret to Buhari. So who is deceiving who? He said, I know what loyalty is and I am a very loyal person. Those who are not loyal, I wish them well. I am loyal to the president. I am loyal to the party. You see, they are loyal only to those are the people they are loyal to the party and the, the president. If the party says it is me, thank God. But if the party says it is not me, whoever the party chooses, I will support. If the president or the party chooses someone else, I will support the person. And if they choose me, I will be glad and come back here to worship God. In his speech, the River State Chairman of the APC, Mr. Emeka Beke, expressed optimism that he would be the chairman to produce the next president of Nigeria and a governor in the state. Sir, go home and sleep. Rivers delegates will vote for you because all of us from Rivers have benefited from you and this is the time to pay you back. Beke added. Mm. Loyal to party, loyal to the president. That is all they know. They will never talk about the people. They will never talk about the people. He has experience. Good and fine. To me, I just believe that uh, this is a sign for him to to step down. You guys to step down, Mr. Man. Step down, step down, step down. That fits no that sits no fit you at all. Dear Nigerians, I'm telling you, Hashiwaju is the best for you. If you know, Lagos order testify to this. Hey? Tinubu is the first governor in the political history of Nigeria to appoint an Igbo man as a commissioner. And so, so because he appoints only one man, and the other people should go and sleep inside those bed. And for what use is the man that he appointed? If Igbo be president, Nabate, Dave Umayi and Peter Obi are better than Yotinubu. Well, everybody is fighting for his own, but unfortunately, none of them is patriotic enough to move this country forward. They are so, so unpatriotic. That is the problem we have with them. For those who are not aligning with all these uh, irresponsible politicians, what we are interested in is how the life of uh, of Nigerian man will be better off to a very large extent. Those who are putting more efforts to work, their hard work will pay for, uh, pay for it at the end of the day. Not that you are working, 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 working. At the end of the day, you see that uh, nothing is working. It's, it's not work. It's not worth it. And that's why you see a lot of people going into crime. A lot of people have invested, have done genuine things over the time. At the end of the day, the more they do it, the more they get frustrated, the more they get discouraged. Everybody level of adaptability or level of tolerance differs. It will differs from person to person. So that's how you see some people cannot just hold themselves. Some people cannot just even try to say, okay, let me just continue to hold on. It's not everybody, but some people have that a tendency to to hold on but those who cannot do that because the way this way the system is running is really very 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 disheartening so they will tell you this and that at the end of the day nothing will happen so amichi good luck to you and like you said if you win fine if you don't win you work with uh, the other people